Shalom Yaladim and Shana Tova. Today we're going to make a couple crafts that have to do with the story of Jonah being swallowed by the whale. On Yom Kippur, we read in the Bible the story of Jonah. The story of Jonah teaches us that God wants us to change our ways. God wants to forgive us for any wrongs that we did during the year. So what you'll need for this craft is a paper plate, just a cheap paper plate. If you don't have a paper plate, you can also use a piece of paper that you cut into a circle. You'll need scissors, some crayons or markers or watercolor paints, whatever you have, a marker, and either a stapler, some tape, or some glue. So the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to cut a wedge into our paper plate. So a wedge looks like a slice of pie or a pizza slice. So you just go right in and you cut your wedge. Just like that. And then you take your stapler or your tape or your glue and you just attach it to the rest. You attach the wedge to the rest of your paper plate or your piece of paper. Just like that. See how it looks like a big fish now? And then what you can do is you can put an eye on it and you can color it however you want. You can make it a rainbow fish if you're familiar with that story or just really any color that you want. And then just to make it kind of fun, I have here a little Jonah. Oh no, Jonah! He gets swallowed by the whale. The next project is a little bit more involved, a little bit, um, yeah, it might be a little bit harder, but it's, it's origami, which is the Japanese art of paper folding. So we are going to make first a boat, the boat that Jonah was on that he got thrown overboard from and then using that same paper folding, we are going to make the big fish, the whale that Jonah got swallowed by. So for this, all you need is paper. First, you fold your paper in half like that. Then you open up your sheet of paper and you fold the sides into the first crease that you made. So it looks like that. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold each of the four corners into that first fold that it can be folded into. We go around and we do that with all the corners. And you wanna make sure that you're kind of pressing down to make your creases really, really good. So after you fold in the four corners, your paper should look like this. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold, origami's a lot of folding, you're gonna fold those sides in and keeping the corners tucked underneath so it looks like that. And then you can turn it over and fold it back on that first, first crease that you made. Kind of looks like a letter, like an envelope. And then see how there are corners here? You're gonna fold those corners in just like you did the first time you folded the corners in. So it looks like that. And you do that with your other corner. You 
fold everything back. And look at that. You have a boat. This is the boat that Jonah right here was sailing in. And then the waves started coming in and Jonah got thrown overboard. And now we're gonna see what happened to Jonah when he got thrown overboard. So what you're gonna do now is you're gonna either take scissors or you can just tear. You're gonna tear a little bit into your boat. See that? Right in the middle. And then you're gonna open up your boat and tear the sides a little bit. Just a little bit. The same, the same length you made that first tear. So the two sides of the boat and the middle of the boat get a little tear. And then once you've torn those pieces, you're gonna fold back, fold back those pieces like that. And you'll do that on each side. Just like that. And then you open up, you can open up the boat. And now it can be a big fish that swallows Jonah. Oh no, Jonah! And Jonah's inside the big fish. If you want, you can color. You can color your big fish, your whale. I like to put an eye on mine. And you can make it look like a nice fish or a more mean fish, however you want. I'm gonna make mine look nice on one side. See how the eyebrow kind of makes it look like a kind of a nice fish. And then on the other side, I'm gonna make it look like a mean fish. See how that makes it look like a mean fish? And there you have it. So you started with just a piece of paper and you made the boat. Then you did a little bit more folding, a little bit of tearing, and you made the fish, the whale that swallowed Jonah. I hope you enjoyed these crafts. Take a look at some of the other links that I've shared for Yom Kippur. Chag Sameach and all the best to you in 5781.